Hello, my name is Cody Canning and I'm the director of the First Year Learning Initiative here on campus. That is my daughter's giraffe. I didn't want to uh, make a video with that in the background without acknowledging that it exists and also acknowledging how strange it is that it's just over my shoulder. Anyway, beyond that, I'm also a faculty member in the first year seminar and I also have the privilege of directing that. If you're watching this video, it's because you're in a class uh, working with an incredible uh, faculty member who uh, is incredible on their own merit, but also gracious um, insofar as they've agreed to work with my office, the First Year Learning Initiative, in um, supporting, honoring, and facilitating a, a student experience survey in the name of equity. So several times throughout the semester, four to five times, you will receive an email from FYLI, F-Y-L-I, First Year Learning Initiative. And it will prompt you for a, to, uh, to take a survey on your experience. Five to seven minutes of your time is all that uh, it will take. It is an entirely anonymous survey. The only thing that will um, ask you for anything uh, other than your opinion is a demographics section at the end of the survey, which will ask you, about your gender identity, uh, your ethnic identity, maybe ask some other questions, all of which are entirely voluntary to answer. So why are we sending out this survey to you? What is the survey about? Phyli this year is making a strong move towards intentionally and explicitly focusing on equity of outcome and focusing on other issues around inclusion. So inclusion, I'm certain, is a word uh, you have heard uh, often. And when we talk about inclusion, we're talking about uh, the state of including or of being included within a group or a structure. You can see I'm looking over to read it because it's a long definition. More than simply diversity and numerical representation, and this is the most important part, inclusion involves authentic and empowered participation and a true sense of belonging. Now part of Pursuing inclusion is also pursuing equity. So not equality, but equity. Equity is defined as the state, quality, or ideal of being just, impartial, and fair. The concept of equity is synonymous with fairness and justice. It is helpful to think of equity as not simply a desired state of affairs or lofty value. But to be achieved and sustained, equity needs to be thought of as structural and a systemic concept. Now, what does that all, that, all of that mean? In the United States, in higher education, at every level, and across institutions all over the country, it is not uncommon to see that students feel a diminished sense of belonging that they might feel outcasted or alienated in a classroom space, that there are any number of factors that can actually cause them to have a lower grade than other students. And it has nothing to do with their intelligence. It has nothing to do with their academic potential. So what we're interested in Phyli is learning about the student experience so that we can start closing what are called equity gaps. In other words, where student, certain student populations may, for example, not be earning the same rate of passing grades as another student group. This is not about diminishing rigor. This is not about uh, reducing the difficulty of classes. Rather, it's looking at, to the, to the definition, systemic and structural factors that may reduce belongingness, safety, uh, growth mindset, so that we can learn more about the student experience. Now your faculty member <clears throat> is agreeing to this in an exchange, uh, which is, is so wonderful that they're, they're, they're agreeing to do this. Uh, we will be giving them regular reports about what you and your fellow students are saying about the classroom experience. The reason your faculty members are participating in this is because they wanna hear your opinions too. Um, and their goal is to learn about what you're saying and make improvements or modifications to how they operate in the classroom, 
what sort of learning experiences uh, are made available to you, so on and so forth. Um, so your feedback matters. Your feedback is going to be read. Your voice is important. Um, you're going to receive emails directly from us in the First Year Learning Initiative. Again, PhiLi. It will come from PhiLi at nau.edu. And we're really grateful um, for your thoughts and opinions. The giraffe is grateful for your thoughts and your opinions. Um, so thank you. And we really look forward to hearing what you have to say and uh, striving all the time to improve the quality of what we're able to offer you here in NEU. So thank you. Good luck this semester. Bye.